Praise the Lord, precious brothers and sisters in Christ. It's your sister Genevieve here. And I've met with my dear brother in Christ, Brother Stefano. Brother Stefano, say hi to everyone. Oh, hi. <laughs> Hallelujah. Well, we're standing here for among this uh, busy place what they call Liverpool outside the shopping mall and shops and people all around sitting, standing, walking around. And we have one message for every single person. Follow Jesus. Repent from your sins. He's the only one who can set you free. He's the one who can just write your name in the book of life in heaven. So you don't believe in heaven, or they believe there is another way to get to there, but that Jesus claims to be the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the heavenly place, to the Father, only through Jesus. He's the only one who just pay the price of the cross of the cup. That's what the people need to understand, need to wake up. They come out of a dead religion we have any. And so did the Jesus. Amen. It's any other news will be false ones. Politicians tell you this and this and that, but we don't get involved with them. It is others, businessmen, very intelligent fools who tell you other things. But when you come to Jesus will have problems, let him sort it out. It's very simple, very easy, and costs you nothing. That's what I have to tell you, beautiful people, whatever you may be, whatever country, or language, or color, or your skin is, whatever religion you may have. God is not interested in any religion. Interested in you to have a relationship with Jesus. Open your heart and accept Him as a person of honor. That's what you need to do. Amen. The beautiful, precious people out there. Jesus, by the Christ, for us. Hallelujah. Jesus, glorious and holy name. That's what we're standing here for. Amen. We don't just make up sense of Bible. We don't have to worry about what the people are saying about us. Call us crazy. We think it out of our minds. And yet, God, our Creator, knows Jesus is standing by us. And the angels of God protecting us from every attack of the enemy. The enemy, who is that? The devil. The enemy of God, the enemy of people who prevented the good news gone forth into this world. And yet his destiny is the lake of fire. And those that disregard Jesus and rejected him, we're gonna follow him with the place we call hell. There is no other way. It is a place we call heaven, place we call hell, and nothing in between. Who you may Amen. follow. You know your time is gonna be up on that. You know your love here on earth will come to an end. And then the body gets into the grave. From dust you became, you came into the dust you returned, but your spirit and your soul lives on forever. Repent of hers. This is the only news we have to tell you who don't have to go to a university or to some kind of a special school to learn how to tell people about the love of God. It's so easy. So beautiful, so kind. Jesus laid down his life for us all at the ultimate price because he loves us so much. What about you? You know your time will be up sooner or later. Do you know what I know? You may think I'm young, handsome, beautiful. I have to do this and that and make money, make just myself. A person who the people talk about me. If you like it or not one day, believing it or not, we all come to the end of your life. When are you going to be that? You're 16 now or 21? Maybe 28. I'm 78. Will I be 99 or will be 101? Can you compare eternity with 101 years? Eternity that is a starting point. But never ends. This love is only terror. Ter what is the word? Temporary. Soon you are going to go. And my famous preacher, Jim Swaggart, sings a song. In a twinkling of an eye, we will be gone. Where are we going? A lot of people come to the place for the God, the Father, in Jesus' name, have prepared many mansions. Don't worry about wealth. And things here on earth will come to an end one day. Nothing is to be worth even a big packet of solid gold with a billion dollars would it be worthless. Amen. But we count this 
we have treasures up in heaven. You may don't believe it. I will say this is your problem. Read the book of books. Find out who you are. That book is called the Word of God, the Bible. May God bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, dear brother. Amen. Listen to this message and repent. The kingdom of heaven is near. Yes, I've got my signs today and the Lord has sent me and Brother Stefano to come to a suburb called Liverpool. There's many, there's many in Liverpool that are sitting around enjoying a good, um, enjoying a coffee, lunch, food. And I just started preaching before and and people were not very happy, but we have to, we have to, we have to tell them, brothers and sisters, because time is so short. Time is so, so, so short. And God has commanded us to go out into all nations and preach the good news of the gospel. Hallelujah. So, Lord, before I start preaching, Father, I just lift up each and every individual person in this area in Jesus' name. And I pray, Father God, for your intervention in the name of Jesus. And I pray, Lord, your will to be done in Jesus' name. And I pray, Father God, that each and every single person sitting here today will hear the sound of my voice. But they'll understand that it is you speaking. They'll understand that it is you urging them to repent turn from their sins and we just pray Lord you just touch their hearts right now in Jesus mighty name we pray Father God Lord Jesus that you humble them Father God that they will humble themselves before you Lord hallelujah I just rebuke every unclean spirit in the name of Jesus stopping these people from knowing the truth hallelujah we rebuke the spirit of interference we bind up all governing principalities in Jesus' name. We destroy the works of the enemy today in Jesus' name. God bless you, everybody. Hallelujah. We come with a message. A good message for you. Hallelujah. Have you got Jesus? Have you got eternal life? Do you want Jesus? Thank you, you, you want eternal life? You love Jesus. Praise the Lord. Are you born again? No. You're not born again. Well, I want to encourage you. So you're born a Christian and you're dying a Christian, but you're not born again. Do you read your Bible, my friend? Tell I the wish, truth. I wish, I wish, <laughs> I wish health hey, let's finish yep. one life and first. good then health to it. everybody <laughs> and every human. You wish health and, and wealth all, to everyone. And we're all going to the same address. And what happens when we die? We're all going to beautiful places. Oh, so your attitude is eat, drink, What's be merry, because if we if die you, tomorrow... <laughs> if you're with beautiful people, you got beautiful answers. And what happens when you take your last breath? Where are you going? There's only two places. Going to that beautiful place. Called heaven. Do you realize that heaven is for those who are born again? You just said that you're not born again, my friend. Princess, thank you. This is a message of love. Jesus is I urging you, you to princess. come to him today and call upon his name. You. You're going to receive salvation. Thank you. But you have to respect my feelings. And, and my I do respect, but my job is to preach the good news. See, God loves princess. you so much, he's given you free will. Thank you, Princess. Next, next, thank you. If you die without Jesus, my friend, Respect you can't enter the son. kingdom of heaven. Thank you. Thank you. Think about it. Yes, thank sir. You. Thank you. Do you I know like that? Your, I like your jeans, actually. True you like huh? my jeans. Amen. Amen. Yes, nice. Very, very good. You know what? He loves you and he died for you too. And he died to set you free. And he's the only way to heaven. No other way, friend. You might have all the money in the world, all the wealth in the world. Today, Jesus is urging you to repent and turn from your sins. 
Call upon his name because he loves you so much. Jesus is the answer. There's no other way to heaven. For God loved the whole world. He sent his only son that whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord Jesus shall not perish but shall receive everlasting life. So please trust in Jesus as your savior. Friends, this is a message of love. God loves you and he sent his son Jesus to die for your sins. That Jesus is the only way. No one else died for your sins. Only Jesus died for your sins. So we want to encourage you today. Call upon the sweet, precious name of Jesus. Because he's the only way. There's no other way. Jesus said there'll be many scoffers and mockers mocking and scoffing. They don't know what they're doing. Jesus is the answer. I can't hear the customers because you're yelling out. Oh, really? I can't do my job. Okay, well, I'm walking past now. I will, and I want to encourage you. Ask Jesus into your heart, sweetheart. He died for your sins. The Bible says that he died for your sins. It's my job to warn the people. I know many people are angry at, at the sounds of our voices. Many people are angry that we're yelling and telling people to repent. But it's the only way to wake people up. God has commanded us to be his voice. And the enemy wants to silence us. But who are we going to obey? We want to encourage all of you sitting over there. Jesus is soon to come back. Have you got eternal life? Have you got Jesus? <laughs> Friends, Jesus loves you so much and he died for your sins. And I want to encourage you to come to Jesus while there is still time. Trust in Jesus with all of your heart. Lean not on your own understanding. Jesus said you must be born again. Excuse me, we can't hear. He's the only way. So trust in him because he's coming back soon. Heaven is real and hell is real. And Jesus paid the price so that you don't have to go to hell. So I encourage you today, call upon his name. For time is short. Heed this message, my friends. Repent. Turn from your sins. He's coming back. He's coming back at an hour that we think not. Jesus loves you. It might be your last day on earth. Have you got Jesus? Have you inherited eternal life? Hallelujah. The Bible says, For all have sinned and all have fallen short of the glory of God. We have all fallen short of God's glory. There is not one of us that is righteous in his eyes. He is pleading with you today. Come to Jesus. Jesus loves you, my friend. And Jesus loves you too. You believe? You believe Jesus? Are you Muslim or Christian? Are you Muslim or Christian? You're Muslim. Do you believe? Well, I know that Muslims love Jesus, but you know that the Jesus that you worship is not the right Jesus. You know that Jesus is more than a prophet. He's God in the flesh. You think Jesus is a prophet? He's a prophet. No, well, that's what the Quran says, but he's more than a prophet. He's a prophet before, before Muhammad. Before he's Muhammad. Before Muhammad, a couple of years. And he said, and after me, in coming, when Jesus said after me someone else is coming he was speaking about the Holy Spirit he said that God the Father will send the Holy Spirit Muhammad is not the Holy Spirit my friend the one that Jesus said was coming after him he was talking about the Holy Spirit who is known as the Comforter and Jesus said that the Holy Spirit will live inside of us as born-again Christians so Muhammad can't be with us because he's not a spirit and he doesn't go everywhere that we go. Hey. Muhammad was a prophet of Islam. And I want to encourage you, Muhammad came 650 years after the crucifixion of Jesus. Uh, Jesus is coming, coming, coming later when I when coming there at uh, Al Mahdi al Muntazar. When he came to Mahdi al Muntazar, he came, came in Jesus. So you believe that Jesus will come back to judge? He come back because he, yes. he's, he's, that's, that's it, that's it, he's died. Muhammad is died, but Jesus doesn't die. 
Why do people say that Muhammad was the greatest? Wasn't Je Jesus was greater because he performed many miracles, he healed the sick, he raised the dead to life. Muhammad didn't perform any miracles. There's power in the name of Jesus. Do you know that many Muslims have had encounters with Jesus? Jesus Christ is God and he loves you and he died for your sins and he rose again. And I want to encourage you to believe in the Gospels of Matthew, Mark, Luke and John because they were the men that walked with Jesus, they ate with Jesus, they sat with Jesus and ultimately they saw him being crucified on a cross. Muhammad wasn't there when they did that. So Muhammad says in your Quran that it was not Jesus that was crucified but it was another person. I want to encourage you that Jesus did die for our sins and he did rise again and he loves you. He loves you so much and I want to encourage you, pray and ask him to say, Jesus, who are you? I want to know the truth. The Bible says if you seek the truth, you will find it and it will set you free. Truth is a person and his name is Jesus. Hallelujah. He is the son of God. Your Quran says that Allah doesn't have a son. It's true, my friend. Allah, your God, doesn't have a son because he's not God. But my God has a son and his name is Jesus. And he died on the cross of Calvary to set us free from our sins. Trust in, in what I'm saying today. I want to see you in heaven and I want you to, to believe that who, G, who Jesus says he is. He loves you so much. Okay? Can I, can I pray for you? Can I pray? Give me your hand. I pray? I pray for you. What's your name? What's your name? Malik. Malik. Lord, I pray for Malik right now in Jesus' name. Lord, that you will open his eyes in Jesus' name. That you will show him that you are the way and the truth and the life. Every spirit of deception, lies and confusion operating in his life, I rebuke it right now in Jesus' name. Show him, Lord. Give him a vision. Give him a dream that you are the true living God. That you are more than a prophet. Hallelujah. That you are the King of kings and Lord of lords and that you did die to set us free. Feel him right now, Lord. I rebuke any sickness or disease the enemy has laid on his life. We bind up any unclean spirit, spirit of addiction to smoking, whatever it is, we break you in Jesus' name. Shana male kobo. Jar male ko hierebosiande. God bless you, Malik. Malik, I love you. And Jesus loves you. And I want you in heaven. You feel something in your heart? You feel something in your heart? It's Jesus. Pray to him and here, give me your hand. Give me your hand. Say, Jesus. Just say, Jesus. Show me who you are. Ask him. He's going to just say, show me who you are. I want to know you. I want to know the truth. He loves you so much, my friend. Okay, have a good day, Malik. Have a good day. <laughs> What's your friend's name? What's your name, sir? Ali. I'm Genevieve. Nice to meet you. you. Can I pray for you? You want me to bless you as well? Um, I have my church, Coptic Orthodox. Oh, Coptic Orthodox. Let me bless you, yeah? Lord, we bless your son right now in Jesus' name. Cover him with your precious blood, Father. I just rebuke anything that is not of you in Jesus' name. I destroy the works of the enemy. Any spirit of sickness or disease or addiction, we break it right now in Jesus' name. Fill him right now, Lord. Give him the desire, Father God, to follow you, to trust in you, not to follow religion. Hallelujah. Give me your hand, my friend. Just say, Jesus, come in my heart. He's already, He's in, already in your heart. Yeah. Okay, so, so you, 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 you follow Jesus' relationship? You read your Bible? Yes. Keep trusting Him. Jesus said we must be born I have again. No I have no doubt. Amen. You believe. Hallelujah. There's power in the Word of God, yeah? The Word of God sets us free and breaks every chain. And the end, all the people, they believe in Him. And yes. At the end, all. Oh, well, not, not everyone. God gives everyone free will. Many people won't come to Him because they... They don't want to follow God, you know, but he gives them free will. Amen. He gives a choice. Amen. Amen. Keep trusting. Read your Bible and repent because he's coming soon and he loves you. Okay. God bless you. God bless you too. Bye-bye, Malik. God bless you, my friend. Bye-bye. You too. You too. Bye-bye. Thank you, Jesus. Are you Muslim? Muslim? Do you know how much Jesus loves you? You know he's more than he's more than a prophet, yeah? Trust in him. The Bible says, For God loved the whole world, he sent his only son. Have a read of the truck that I gave you because he's coming back soon. He's more than a prophet, my friend. He's not just a prophet. And he loves you. And he wants you to come to heaven, okay? Don't believe in a book. 
Believe in Jesus. Hallelujah. He died to set you free. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Your will be done in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. And I just pray, Father God, for the Muslim man, Malik, his name was, that I just prayed for, Father God. And Lord, um, we just pray, Father God, for that spirit of deception to be removed. We bind the work of the enemy. We destroy the works of the Satan in Jesus' name. We cancel the plan of the enemy in the name of Jesus. We bind up every unclean spirit in Jesus' name. We pray, Father, that you will give him visions and dreams and messages, that he will know that you are the true living God. And apart from you, there is no other God. Have your way, Jesus. We are Lababa Sikiriana Maracasante and Anna Maria Corobo Shante. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. You lead us to where you want us to go. God bless you, sir. Jesus loves you. You believe? Are you born again? Born again, Christian? Yes? You read your Bible? Amen. He Jesus is coming back very, very soon. All the signs all around us. Hallelujah. Keep trusting in Jesus. He's the author and the finisher of our faith. You'll never leave us or forsake us. God bless you, sir. You have a good day. You too. Thank okay, bye bye. Thank you, Jesus. Stefano, where's the signs? Oh, they're over there. Oh. Where? Oh, yeah, yeah. Hello. How are you, darling? We've got another sister here. Born again. You're born again? Amen. Amen. There's no other way to be, right? <laughs> Jesus said we must be born again if we wish to enter the kingdom of heaven. Amen. He gives us peace. He gives us joy. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. You, sorry? Liver cancer. You've got liver cancer? Yeah, yeah. Let's believe God, yeah? You want us to just pray for him. I didn't know just yeah? Can yeah. we just pray? We, pray for you. we just pray for your precious daughter right now in Jesus' name, Father God. We just pray, Father God, Lord, for your will to be done in her life. We come against the spirit of cancer. We rebuke the spirit of liver cancer in Jesus' name. We bind up every unclean spirit in the name of Jesus. We destroy the works of the enemy in Jesus' name. What, 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 what was your name, love? Mary. Mary. We pray for Mary right now, Father God. We lift up Mary to you right now in Jesus' name. And we just bind up every unclean, filthy spirit of cancer in Jesus' name. We call on the fire and the power of the Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost and fire, Holy Ghost and power, consume the work of the enemy in Jesus' name. For whom the sun sets free is free indeed. Let the fire and the power of the Holy Ghost consume everything that is not of you in Jesus' name. We pray complete healing and restoration over Sister Mary right now in Jesus' name. Spirit of liver cancer, we bind you, we rebuke you in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Keep trusting in Him. We'll keep praying for you, precious sister. Um, you know, because... Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. You have no pain. And when were you diagnosed? A couple of years ago now. Right. Oh, wow. And you haven't experienced any pain? Yes, yep. Professor Shackle and there is marvellous. Yep. Yes, I'm really surprised. Praise the Lord. Well, just just keep praying and keep trusting Him. Amen. And we'll be praying for you too. <laughs> Amen. Right, well, it was nice to meet you, Mary. God bless you. You have a good day, love. Bye bye now. Hallelujah. Oh, many, many angry people. Hey, Stefano. Many angry people everywhere. Now, um, if you want to pick up the things, we'll go over there. We'll go over there, yeah.
kiara mamale korobo shatana male osiki ana male shana male ondo ika ana male ke shatana male okoro yala basika ika le ondo bosiande Jesus loves you ladies trust in him he's coming back soon flash you did you get one of the tracks the tracks that we give out we'll give you Stefano can you give this the ladies one track me and my friend are just born again Christians and we're just spreading the love of Jesus and we're just encouraging people to put their faith in Jesus because he's the only way. <laughs> this is not religion. This is relationship with Jesus. Hallelujah. And, and we're not Jehovah Witnesses. <laughs> he loves you so much, guys. Bless you. Bless you. Give, give her... Give her well, it, cause they're, That's yeah, right. you take that. And because yeah. one's about the coming of the Lord and one's about yeah. salvation. Thank you so much. Bless you guys. You have a good day. Bless you. You're right. Bye bye. Bye bye. You too. Bye bye. Thank you, Lord. Oh, I know where you're talking. You want to go to the street there? Okay, yes. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Your will be done, Jesus. Repent! 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 For the kingdom of heaven is at hand! Jesus is coming back! Get ready! Are you ready to meet Jesus? Friends, time is short! Time is running out! There's no more time left! Take a look around you at the events that are playing out in the world! Wickedness is increasing. The love of many is growing cold, just as Jesus said it would. Jesus loves you. Hallelujah. Jesus loves you. Yay. Bless you all. Can I bless him? Can I bless your friend? Can I bless him? Lord, we bless him right now. We bind any work of the enemy in Jesus' Thank name. You, You're welcome. Bless you. The Feel him right now. We bind any work of the enemy in Jesus' name. Fill him with the peace and the joy. Set him free and deliver him. Cover him with your precious I'm, blood. I'm joy with you. you. Jesus loves you very much. Thank he died for you. You believe Jesus? I believe you, you believe Jesus? Yes? yes. Christian? Give me your hand. Give me your hand. You want Jesus in your heart? Thank you, you're you want Jesus in your heart? Yeah, yeah. Say, say, Jesus, come in my heart. Yeah, say, Jesus, come in my heart. He loves you very much. Trust in Him. Is that your daughter? Oh, you're beautiful. God bless you. Oh, your husband, let me pray for you. Lord, bless this precious lady, Lord. We bind anything that is not of you in Jesus' name, Father God. We just rebuke the work of the enemy. We cancel the plan of the enemy in Jesus' name. Cover her with your precious blood. Have your way, Lord. Bless this family, Lord. Bless this family, Lord. Cover them with your blood. Surround them with your angels. Place a hedge of protection around them in Jesus' name. Jesus love you very much. Are you Christian or Catholic or what? What do you believe? Where is your family? Oh, men die. So you worship John the Baptist. Is that what you are? John the Baptist? You know that Jesus said that we must not worship any other gods for he is a jealous God. Uh, what is you speak family? Arabic. What is your family? Yeah, give me your hand. Just, what? just repeat after me. Yeah. What say, dear family? Jesus. Say, say, dear Jesus. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> what is your family? I want to encourage you. Read your Bible and ask Jesus to come in your heart. Jesus said we must be born again. Okay. And and this Mendelite religion is actually worshiping John the Baptist. You know what, Jesus. Jesus is the only one we should be praying and worshiping to, not John the Baptist. Uh, John the Baptist John was only a man. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. John the Baptist. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, John the Baptist yeah, even yeah, said yeah, that yeah, one yeah, who is coming John after him. Yeah. Amen. Serious. You're John the Baptist. Yeah. Yes. So, sorry. Sorry. You want me to? You want me to pray for you and bless you? Hallelujah. Yes. What's your name? Yeah. Quiet. Lord, bless this precious daughter of yours in Jesus' name. Lord, we just pray right now for your will to be done in her life. We rebuke the work of the enemy in Jesus' name. Any spirit of deception, lies and confusion, we break you right now in Jesus' name. We call on the fire and the power of the Holy Ghost to consume everything that is not of you right now in Jesus' name. Have your way, Lord. Deliver her. Set her free. We pray for this whole family, Lord. That you remove the scales from their eyes, that they will know there is only one way. For God, you sent your son Jesus into this world to die for our sins. 
presenting your precious Son, the sacrifice of Jesus, that can set us free and cleanse us of our sins. To have your way. We pray for their salvation, Father God. Hallelujah. Your will be done in Jesus' name. Sister, give me your hand. Give me your say. Just say after me. Say, say Jesus. Jesus. Re repeat yes, after yes, me, yes, Jesus. Yes, yes. Say, Jesus, come in my heart. Yes, yes. 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 come in my heart. Is yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, because they, they don't speak. Yes. Yeah. Say, Je Jesus. Repeat, Jesus, come in my heart, and fill me with your Holy Spirit. Okay. So they don't, they don't understand English. Okay. Oh, all good. So I just pray, Father, God, that you put someone in their path who can speak English to them, who can speak their language. But we, we thank you for their humble heart and for their openness and that they want to be blessed and prayed for. And we pray that we, we thank you that we planted the seed today and your will will be done in their lives. Bless them, bless them. Shana maleo bose. Just, uh, okay, let me just get the oil. I'm, I'm just going to get the oil. The Lord's telling me to put the oil. Halamasikliande. Shana maseko yadababasiande. Okay, no, I think I've left it at home. It's okay. All right. God bless you. Okay. God bless you. Okay.